Hello, Lee. Bill Blake here at Bearings RV Center in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Hey, this is the exact 820 Cirrus truck camper that I have in stock that you're considering. Here's a little walkthrough for you. I won't, won't be able to touch just because of the length of the video. I won't be able to touch on everything. But starting on the outside, you do have this compartment right here. This shows your Ames Power inverter right here. It is actually enclosed in a case right there. It's all diamond plated throughout the whole thing. Diamond plated right through here where a lot of truck campers get nicked up from the loading and unloading on your truck. This one will not uh, seal uh, jacks, power jacks. You see the casing is actually sealed right there. So not with the uh, plastic covering so water can get inside of it. I don't know if the, the camera will pick this up, but it does have the roof rack right there as well. Uh, dual pane windows, acrylic windows. It does uh, give you more storage there as well. Uh, outlined in diamond plate as well. So protects whatever is in there as well. Uh, on the rear, you mentioned like you want to take a uh, generator. That's where I would store that as well, right there. That little cap right there is simply sewer hose storage. We'll scan back a little bit. There is the uh, ladder right there so you can access the roof if you need to. I've got the awning out as well. So this does have the rear awning option. Again, this is the Aldi heating system. And those stickers right there is the Asdell sidewalls. Keep that in mind because that's really important. Uh, another storage compartment right there. Lights will automatically come on. That's what you're seeing right there. There's motion censored. And then you've got your water systems right there. So you can, it's color coordinated depending on how you're going to camp, but you can read into that as well. So you can know which way to switch your valves and things like that. Now over here, you do have two LP tanks, not just one, but two. Let's go on the inside real quick. This one's, you can see it from the outside anyway. This one's uh, the silver with the black. Big large entry handle right there. Go inside, right when we go inside, let's get right here. This is your shower right there. Be considered a wet shower, of course. This flips down right here for the sink usage. U dinette right there. That's the table right there is another option. I sent you over the option sheet, so you should have that. But that uh, it's kind of cool. Tons and tons of storage right there. So it just simply opened up like this. And the button's down, of course. It's in the lock position. You've got the uh, north, what we call the north-south bed. It's not going east-west. So it's a little easier. It's a little longer. Storage compartments on each side as well. You've even got the uh, skylight right there. That's a lot of natural lighting in. TV right there, right next to the bed, of course. AC on top. Refrigerator right there. Microwave on the bottom right there. That's a convection microwave, so it does bake. Got some your systems right there as far as the heating system. Going into the kitchen area now. Then you've got just more storage. So really good storage. There's the remote for the uh, jacks right there. Just simply push the buttons and those jacks will go up and down. This one is what we call complete build. So there's no shortages at all right there. It does give you the screen door as well. Just super nice. So just a little scan about it. If you have any questions, again, feel free to give me a call. Thanks, Lee.